Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Clapton Entertains and if you are new here and new to my channel and haven't yet uh, seen my face or content yet before, please subscribe and like this video and if you haven't, if you are subscribed, make sure to hit that notification bell button so that you will be notified for my next videos that come every Thursday. So, welcome back to part 2 of testing my loyalty my fans loyalty so if you haven't checked part one make sure you make sure you check that out right now because it's gonna be really awkward if like if you move on to this part and you have no idea what the heck is going on right now because this is part two so this is the continuing uh, series I guess so yeah this is part two the final part of the social experiment so basically after I filmed that social experiment video I gotten a lot of texts over the past few, few days after I filmed it and now I'm just gonna be showing to you guys and see how long my friends are so right now our current results is one one loyal one hate as uh, zero haters so let's see what <laughs> what the people have to say so let's go on with our first text so this one this okay so basically i'm going to be previewing uh like uh showing y'all some screenshots that i have taken and yeah so this is our first text that i've gotten back and this is was this was still from my hate account but you guys actually banned my hate account i think like two or three days after uh i filmed the video which is pretty wow <laughs> I didn't expect you guys to ban my account that in that fast, but good call, good call. So basically, I just copy and texted this message right here, as you can see, about uh, despising me and some stuff, right? And then look what he uh, replied in a nice formal way. He says, "Quote: No, I personally never." actually met Clapton in person, but on social media such as Instagram, I conclude that Clapton seems to be a caring person towards his friends and family and community. He also has a YouTube channel where he's very insightful, entertaining, and content spread to positivity. I can conclude this is for his YouTube channel. So he already knew already. So shout out to um, Agent Ninja because you're because he has a YouTube channel himself where he does um, these really cool Lego animations or stop motion animations to be exact. And my goodness, it must have taken a long time to like move the single characters to just do one shot. Because if you if y'all don't know what stop motion is, it's basically like a bunch of pictures being organized or like being linked into one so that all those pictures that you have captured it looks like that the character is actually doing something but uh yeah but okay so that's that means two loyals zero haters so far but great job great job ancient ninja and shout out to you so his channel is in the link in the description if y'all want to check out now let's move on to our next person Oh, this next one is from uh, Jai Ray Reyes. Wow, okay, I can't talk today. <laughs> okay, so Jai Ray. So I basically just, you know, I just copy and pasted the text. And I didn't tag him like I did to Agent Hats. But here's a nice and short matter. No, I love Clapton's content. You better stop hating on Clapton before I take matters into my own hands. Lovely threat that you have came of my friend. My long lasting friend. We actually had a long history of uh, our friendship that's been going over since we were little. But I don't think I'm supposed to share about that because I don't know if he has given me per permission to. But that's fine. But yeah, that's some history about ourselves. But yeah, thank you, Jari, bro for um also standing up to me and you also passed this social experiment too as like with uh agent ninja so we got three three loyals zero haters 
But uh, yeah, I mean, I honestly thought, I honestly thought people are gonna be talking behind my back, kind of thing, because sometimes it's you never know if they're actually one hundred percent loyal or one hundred percent truthful. So you gotta learn. You gotta learn. Um, you gotta figure out if they are trustworthy material first, and sometimes I kind of, I kind of, I don't know. I guess I kind of don't trust a lot of people. I mean, there is a lot of people that I don't trust、uh, for particular reasons, and、um, yeah, so it's really hard to find trust, loving, trusting people. Out there, because it's really r- rare. Because, ah,、uh, yeah, I, I'm just because it's rare. But ah,、uh, yeah, thank you, Jiri, for、uh, responding to this text with a lovely thread. I love, I love this thread. Immediately going with a thread, amazing, amazing. But ah,、uh, yeah, let's move on to our next person. So our next one, our next one. Um, is from Matthew. So thank you, Matthew, for um. Yeah, Matthew L. Yeah, L, as you would say. But yeah, okay. This is our next subject. So, I like again. I pasted the message as usual, and he says, but there is a word that I would have to censor out. So I have to find a alternative method to make this、uh, family friendly because we are family friendly con.、Uh, I am a family friendly content creator, so can't have tho- those explicit words revealed. Okay, it says, "Leave him, dude. If you're, if you have nothing nice to say, don't say you're. You don't have to be a about what he likes to do. He liked to do." What did he ever do to you? Okay, another threat. As you know, yeah, a little, yeah, another threat. And nice, nice. I mean, another defending person. So he also passes this test, and now we got four loyals. And sorry, sorry. There was li- literally a car ru-、um, revving up. Like, oh my goodness, who's revving the car in this hour? I mean, then again, it's still yeah, it's still morning. It's like seven right now. Seven right, seven o'clock, and Tuesday, August twenty six is the time that I'm filming this. But yeah, uh, but yeah, thank you for defending me. If this was a real situation. You probably gonna do, probably gonna respond like this, which is a good thing because a lot of people, a lot of people in society, they, I don't know, they just they just hate him, hate hate him or her, like anything about them, about their life, and then I've been questioning or like they'll be questioning like what did they did to you, you know, like. You know you could just you know you could just like go away, right? You don't have to. You don't have to be. You don't have to be so open about being being hate, right? Because what have they ever done to you, right? They've just been following their dreams and stuff, and you're just being like, "Hey, your content sucks. Please stop this cringe." How about how about your how about the one who's literally saying the hate right now for no reason? That's That's full on cringe right there. So, how about you keep your cringe, your cringe comments to yourself, all right? And go to and go someplace else. Anyways, now we're gonna move on to our next person. So, this next comment is from、um, oh my goodness, I already forgotten the username. So I'm sorry. If I forgotten your username, but uh, yeah, I'm sorry. But I don't know if I don't know if you're allowing me to uh say 
uh, say your name in person, but I'll say it. But yeah, this is from a person named Fiona. And no, uh, we're just friends, okay? Not anything else. For all those simp, for all those simp makers out there, okay? Do not, do not make this embarrassing for, for me. Okay, do not be the guy. Do not be some guys at school who literally just like, um, simp me with somebody else. Like, come on, like, what's wrong with, like, why, why you gotta do that, man? Okay, anyway, so basically, she's actually not from my school. She's actually. I actually met her in um, one of my after school class classes. It was a religions class, and it was actually my first year. And there, I saw her with uh, her sister, and then we were just chilling and vibing and stuff. That time, I was actually grade seven, and sh and she didn't believe that I was grade seven at first because of my height. Like, bro, like why, why? Just because that I'm short, that does not mean that my grade has to be decreased, you know? Like, what's wrong with a short grade 7, huh? <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so now she's in another high school. Not, not the one that I go to, but if she was here, oh, man, we could have continued chatting and getting to inch know each other more. But that's fine. I mean, I still talk to her online about... Um, I guess just a nice little chat about life and stuff. And yeah, she's actually introduced me to uh, some of her besties or some of her friends. And some of those friends, they actually follow me. Yeah, so if you haven't followed me yet, which is uh, at Clapinda's Instagram. Not Instagram, because apparently somebody has already taken that. Or like... Yeah, somebody already taken that. Like, why? <sighs> that could have been the perfect username. But that's fine. It was just only one letter. Um, one le letter difference. So, who's gonna really notice, huh? Just like my TikTok, too. <laughs> but, anyways. We're getting off sidetrack. So, here's the quote. So, basically, I didn't catch... The message that I recorded, um, no, I mean, yeah, so basically I just cut it out, this screenshot about me repeated, like, saying the, uh, the intro and stuff, right? Because, yeah, that, I feel like that's kind of getting too repetitive because you know what's gonna happen anyways. So basically, I just cut it and then this is what I got. So basically, she's like saying, girl, like, I'm... I'm like, uh, oh, I'm like her, uh, I don't know. What do, wait, what do, what are those types of girls that, um, assume that, uh, I don't know. Yeah, can someone tell me what, what type of girls are the type of girls who is willing to call any gender girl? Like, not even referring to their proper gender. Because I defined as he, uh, him, and his. As in, I'm a male. And I'm being called girl. And then I was like, okay, that's, that's kind of concerning. I mean, you should have called me bro, but that's fine. So I'll let that one slide. But anyways, she said, girl... I'm defending Cliveden because he didn't do anything wrong. Like, why are you hating on um, on a um, plum? Oh goodness! Wow, on a unproblematic person. Facts. She's literally speaking 100% facts, girl. Like, I didn't do anything wrong. If I was, if I was the hater, right? And this is like referring to the speech I've referred previously about like why you gotta hate on these people for some reason. Like what did they ever do to you? Like they did nothing to you. They're just trying to entertain all their fans as keenly as possible and follow their dreams. And you are trying to be trying to be the person who just pulls them down and making them give up because of you. 
They won't stop. They won't stop、uh, overthinking about thoughts because of you. All right. Haters make our lives worse, as they say. Right, anyways.、Uh, now, I think that's like five, five or six loyals and um, uh, zero haters. So, nice, 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 nice. Nice. Okay, so that's another one down. So, on to the next person. Okay, so basically, yeah. So, basically, this is my、uh, previous. A、uh, previous person that I reviewed my loyalty test on, and、uh, if you known from part one, his username is actually Aiden La、uh, Aiden La Ha zero zero seven, and this is literally the continuous text after. So no, it's this should not say.、Uh, just a sec, that should not say today, because it's not today. You know, so uh, okay. Anyways, so basically, after um, after he、uh, saw it, he screenshotted the conversation, and that that right there is actually what the profile looks like before it got banned. And then sh- he says, "Oh my goodness, Cliveden." And then I'm trying to play it casual and be like, "Huh." He's trying to make me join, and then I'll be like, "Oh, I never thought this day would come again." I don't know, man. I know, man. What should I do? If you are a real fan of me, you know what to do. He's being mean to me, and then yeah, okay. That's that's another one. That's another screenshot right there. And then、uh, oh, okay. I just leaked ninjas. I mean, um, Agent Hat's message, and then the last text that he, I ever got, and I believe it says, "Nah, man, I gotta support Clivenio." Nice. So basically, this is just after the after、uh, part one. So basically, he's still a loyal. So I conclude this test as my fans to be. Or like some of my fans to be um ninety percent loyal, ten percent unknown. Actually, no, 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 no. What am I doing? Okay, no. Ah,、uh, I think it's like um two. Nah, that doesn't make it. Actually, no. Like five percent, five percent of my fan page, which I checked just now. Is、uh, loyal, and the other ninety five percent is unknown because I haven't texted all y'all guys yet. But since my account was banned and it was having some troubles with texting everyone, I couldn't text anyone. So now, what I'm supposed to do? I guess I just gotta leave it there for now. Ah, yeesh. But I think. There is like, there is like a couple of people that might hate me. I know, I know. I actually do know some people who might hate me. So, updating the hater count, we're probably gonna put it like a、um, one to three sort of thing. Actually, no, 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 not one to three. Like, nah, it's a whole, it's a whole friend group, as you might say. So basically, I guess like about six. <laughs> Six haters, but you think that's gonna bother me? Six people trying to hate hate on my life and hate of how my routine goes? Nah, I'm not gonna let six haters just ruin me. I mean, I still got plenty to live, so don't even try to pull me down. All right, I'm not the weak. Okay, I'm literally the most determined person as possible. Okay, I would literally sacrifice anything for anything. I don't even know what I just said. I was just trying to be wise. But yeah, that's my last person, and let's head on out to outro. So that will be the end of the loyalty test of part one and part two. Now, what did I learn from all this is that a lot of people, some people, it's actually no, no, no. What? Oh my goodness. Okay, life lesson here that I actually learned throughout this whole experiment is that 
it's rare to find loyal people lo loyal worthy no loyal trustworthy people in your life and also there is still people out there that might be hating not just me but other content creators and twitch creators or etc too so let this be a message to them that if you ever having trouble with a hater okay just ignore them all right they don't affect you only your fans do your fans will protect you no matter what okay this is why you're a content creator in the first place because you are trying to entertain fans out there and your fans are liking your content and the way your routine goes so do not let your haters get into you all right because at the end if you ignore all haters you'll be become the most successful out of all of the haters in the world anyways so that will be the end of my video so if you haven't yet please subscribe and like this video and you if you haven't yet make sure to hit the notification be bell button so that you will be notified for my next videos every Thursday and yeah that's all for me and I'll see you in the next one bye